Hey guys, it's Neo Second here. About a week ago, I made a couple po uh, polls relating to Higurashi when they cried that I wanted those of you who have been uh, watching uh, said series of mine to consider uh, voting on, and well, I wanted to make this quick little video announcement to go over the results with all of you. Looking at the first poll, I asked you guys how you wanted me to proceed with Higurashi when they cry how after I come back from my short break from the series. And most of you have voted with option B, to, and that is to have me finish what arcs of Higurashi are currently available before I move on to Yumi Neko, the sequel, the sequel uh, game to Higurashi. A came, in a, a came in at a reasonably close second, but since I made it clear that majority that majority uh, is going to that the majority vote is going to be the winner on both these polls, B is pretty much what I'm going to end up doing. So. I'm going to finish Higurashi in its entirety, what's what's currently available. The main story arcs, the console arcs, whatever whatever is currently available, before I move on to Yumi Neko. Regardless of whether or not uh, Manga Gamer finishes uh, Chapter 8 of the main story or not. Hopefully they will before I get to uh, Chapter 7. But time will tell on that, I suppose. But either or... I'm going, to I'm going to finish everything that Higurashi has to offer before I move on to Yumi Neko. As for the second poll, in what order do you want me to experience Higurashi's entire story, most of you have chose option C to let me be the one to decide how I want to do it. Although option A was damn close to tying with, uh, option, with option C. So... I think I'm going to just uh, th think about this one for a little bit here, since you guys clearly want me to want me to be the one to um, decide what I want to do here. But I'm kind of leaning towards option A to just do the entire main story first before I move on to the console arcs and the other extra content. But I'm not going to dismiss the possibility I might try decide to do something totally different. But currently, that's where I'm leaning. So. Basically, um, we'll worry about what order I'm going to uh, I'm going to do things once I come back from my break. Is all you guys really need to concern yourselves about. And that's pretty much all I wanted to go over. Now I'm not going to do video announcements for every single new poll I make on the Discord server, except for the ones that I either really want some feedback from you guys who watch me on YouTube and BitChute. Or if there's uh, any other important announcements that I feel are worth a dedicated vi a, a dedicated video. So if you want to stay up to date to, towards every every new poll that I may make in the future, I would recommend just periodically checking back on the Discord server, along with any other announcements I may make there. And I'm with that being said, I think I'm just going to go ahead and bring this little announcement to a close. I hope I wish you all a fantastic day and take care of yourselves.